here we are, uh, the Val d'Or. Uh, it's been a long, long day. Up to back margin, a little spot. Just starting to ride in Jamie's in margins. Two up there and one right, tucked down into like a little alcove. Hopefully he'll be back from his at night, with a nice, some sort of creature. Uh, but if not, uh, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. I see it's just like a little one, like a little moggy or something like that. Baby, isn't it? Right. Uh, as you can see, conditions are absolutely terrible. Jamie's already had a fish. He had a 16-pounder, and I've got my two margin rods in. I'm putting some spot out. Uh, over the top of my left hand rod, fishing it round the bar. Get this spot in conditions are absolutely terrible it's the night after that um, hurricane Brian or Brian or whatever it's called come down uh, it's been a tough night the rain's been absolutely relentless uh, but we're determined just to keep going and keep pulling on uh, hoping, hopefully the back margins are gonna produce some of us today middle rods just fucking absolutely bounced off James going to the shower I'm watching rods don't bounce little fuckhead I'm just gonna go after gun dry Jamie's rods here I'm really gonna have to work for this now and I have just gone over my line I think yes I have so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go under under there and probably under this one Uh, under this one and I'm gonna get the net ready as I'm, as I'm gonna have to get some big it's taking it, it's taking line, it's taking line This is quite magic. I mean, I'm absolutely buzzing. I hope this is recording nicely. Oh, it's a calf. It's a calf. It's a calf. Definitely wasn't expecting that. Great fight. Massive fight. Looks like a nice one. Let it tear itself out a little bit. Magic. Absolutely magic. This is this is why I come. Oh big one. Get in there, lad. So uh, it's been a fucking really hard couple of days. Um the storm passed over and went. And then I'm finally off at Mark. Uh, so let's hope. That is uh, onwards and upwards from here. Yeah, very nice, very pleased. Hopefully we'll have a good uh, rest of the week.
So, it's Tuesday. Uh, just going to do a quick overview of what's been happening. First night, Jamie had one. £16, £17, wasn't it, Jamie? Yeah. I lost one or two uh, in the next couple of nights. Uh, that was Sunday night. Then yesterday, which is Monday, I had a £27 mirror. I uh, only just cast my PVA bag in and just saw the indicator just went whack, it hit me rod and then bang, straight back down, complete drop back, line slack, massively slack. So, struck into it, reeled in, whack, hit into it, just an absolute lump. Um, took me on a bit of a merry, merry chase around everywhere. Um, I had our Jamie there to help me this time and it wasn't as hard. But yeah, the uh, next bit of footage is something quite special. Uh, your personal best. So yeah, just a uh, back margin, £45.5. New PB. What a fucking massive girl she is. Look at that. That is why we come here. Absolutely fantastic. Look at that. Ah. Wow. Over the moon. Honestly, amazing. Yes. Right, so it's, uh, it's day four, Wednesday. Um, what a night we had last night. Uh, four fish caught in total. Uh, three grass carp and a... No, what, two grass carp and a mirror? Two, two grass carp, carp, two mirrors. First bite, it was about half nine. My left hand rod ripped off, got it in. It was a personal best at 28.7. Grass carp. Jamie's in. Let it go. Let it go. So, oh, it's a, oh, it's a grassy. A nice grassy as well. It's a nice grassy. Pick it up. That's a nice 28 and a half pound grassy for the JB. New personal best. Look at that, fucking fantastic, mate. Yes, Jamie, well done, new PB. Good stuff, lad. Well done, great stuff. That is a really nice fish, mate. Yeah, went on, well, after, went on after that. I mean, within space of two hours, caught another two. I mean, as soon as we got rods back out, back out again, fish on. Um, but on last rod, uh, on the last run he had, um, it was uh, a 20, 26, 25, 26, 26, 2, 26 mirror. 2 mirror. Uh, same time, uh, my one, my right hand rod went off as well. Um, yeah, 31 pounds four. Yeah, so there's a a, a bit of a, a skeptical. Double fish photo. I don't think we were quite dressed for the occasion. Yeah, uh, this one don't like getting caught. Me and Jamie were just stood there talking about what if the rods were about to go off now. Left hand rod. Uh, <coughs> little 12 mil dumbbell in a PVA bag. Pellets. Just gonna get ready to pass this under my rods. Plenty of fight in this one. Uh, 
No, I've never had a fight like this before, like... <sighs> this wants to fight. Back on it. That is not a baby sturgeon. That could possibly be. Taking our tail and uh, hopefully soon it's just gonna wake up a little bit. Kind of they do go lethargic when you've caught them. Best thing you can do is let them go straight away. So just gonna keep hold of it. It's starting to move now. this one before. Playing it hard because it just took so long to fly. Second line, second line, it's just like that sturgeon today. Just like that sturgeon today. Uh, well, just got it in and uh, it's uh, definitely a PB. Um, yeah, I think we're talking excess of 40, maybe 50 pounds. Yeah. Amazing. Let's get it out. Let's uh, get it away. Look at that. Look at the size of that. Fifty-five, ten, or twelve pounds. First big. Cat. What an absolute result, buzzing, look at that, what a scrap, same again, 12 mil dumbbell, filled with pellets, it's been out 5 hours, absolutely fantastic, third PB of this trip, I cannot believe it, look at that, wow, get in, come on. There we have it, after the cat last night, it's been a quiet night but uh, 34 pounds, 34 pounds on the nose, uh, nice chunky little, uh, chunky little mirror, awesome, let's get some pictures. Right, so it's 
to half past five morning. Uh, Pelly was going off again. Um, and hopefully this is going to be fish number eight. Gonna be in the net. Uh, fingers crossed for something over five pounds. Here we go. 4.40 of the trip. A nice diamond back staging. Wow, fantastic. 44 pounds on the nose. Let's get some pictures done and get her back. Oh, so it's just for going into last night. Uh, Jamie's had a really rocky few days. Just to cooking down there. He's got burgers on go. What rips off? Jamie's left hand rod. Oh, Jimmy, come on, lad. Fucking hell, I'm buzzing for you. It's not bad. It's not bad. Tell about head on it. Oh, and there you go, Jamie. Well, we're on last morning. And uh, this looks like it's going to be his last fish. This is his trip. Uh, what an absolutely fantastic, fantastic trip. Uh, this is my 10th fish, Jamie's had 7, Jamie had a flurry of uh, a fish last night, unfortunately not another 30, but what an absolute fantastic trip, uh, yeah let's get it back, uh, get some pictures done. Well, that's the end of his trip, uh, seven days out at the Val d'Or, what a trip it's been, 17 fish caught in total, um, it's just been amazing. I've got a winter campaign uh, on a water that I've never fished before, so that's going to be quite interesting. Been along five years with these, five years, same crocs, good luck, but well, I think it's time that I need to uh, get me sent off down to a shoe zone or something and get me sent some new crocs. <laughs> so. So long.